Okay, I've taken out part of the cowl over here, and the next thing that we need to do is to go ahead and then um, remove the arms so that we can pull out the rest of the cowl. Now, there's really not much to it. You can see it slips on pretty well, and all you have to do with this one is I'll usually take a small hammer and very gently slip it up, and um, it should it should pop right out. And then I'll go ahead and pull out the rest of the um, connections, and I'll move the arms, and then we'll be able to pull the cowl out, and we'll have full access to the uh, the motor and the transmission.